A memorial of stuffed animals and flowers sit on a doorstep to a house where a 19-year-old mother was killed. She was sleeping when her house caught fire and there was no time to get out. Sorry, there's nothing else I could do for her. You can't blame yourself, Eric. You tried to save her, right? Eric Harder is consumed with grief and guilt. He survived a deadly fire that killed his 19-year-old girlfriend, Emily Rolou. I woke up and it was pitch black. It was full of smoke. I didn't know where I was at, you know. Mm -hmm. I heard a girl scream, but it sounded like she was far away. I thought maybe someone was outside. I got down as low as I can and started moving around trying to find somebody, and I couldn't find anybody. You know, when I started feeling like I was going to pass out, I just started reaching around. I felt the window, and I punched it and jumped out. Sources say the house may have been firebombed, but no accelerants were found on Emily's body. These old mugshots were from previous drug arrests, and police say she was involved in prostitution. But Eric says she was just a good mom trying to get back on track. She was a good girl. She's only 19 years old. You know, sometimes people get mixed up in the wrong things. But I mean, nobody ever deserves anything like this. Friends of Emily believe this fire was set intentionally and they're vowing to get justice. Right now, police will only say they are looking for three white females to question them in connection with this fire. In Detroit, Marielle Lou, Fox 2 News.